Welcome back! In this video, we will go over some of the major muscles of the upper extremity. Before we start, this right here is the arm, this is the forearm, and this is the hand. In the anatomical position of the body, this surface right here is the posterior surface of the upper extremity, whereas this right here is the anterior surface. The thumb guides you toward the lateral aspect, and the pinky guides you toward the medial aspect of the upper extremity in the anatomical position. Starting with the first muscle, you can see this is the clavicle. This is part of the pectoralis major muscle. This right here is the deltoid muscle. Moving posteriorly, you can see the spine of the scapula. This is the teres major muscle. This right here is the teres minor muscle. This muscle is the infraspinatus muscle, which is located inferior to the spine of the scapula. And right here, we can see part of the supraspinatus muscle. Posteriorly, on the scapula, we can see the subscapularis muscle. Moving to the muscles on the arm, this right here, as we mentioned earlier, is the posterior aspect. So this is posteriorly is the triceps brachii muscle. We can see the three heads of the triceps brachii muscle. Moving anteriorly, we can see the brachialis muscle. This right here is the biceps brachii muscle. It has two heads. We can see the entire biceps brachii muscle. Moving to the muscles of the forearm, before we start, let's remind ourselves that this is the posterior surface of the forearm. Toward the pinky, this is the medial aspect. Toward the thumb, this is the lateral aspect. And this right here is the anterior surface of the upper extremity. Starting with the first muscle right here, this is the pronator teres muscle. Notice how the pronator teres muscle is located on the anterior aspect to allow us to pronate the forearm as if you're playing basketball. That's the pronator teres muscle. Next, right here, this muscle, it is running toward the thumb. Also, it is on the anterior surface. So this is the flexor, allows us to flex carpi radialis muscle. That is the flexor carpi radialis muscle. Next to it, we are still on the anterior surface. This muscle right here, if you follow the tendon, you can see part of the tendon, it is running toward the palm. So this is the palmaris longus muscle. Moving toward the medial aspect, we are still on the anterior surface. However, we are closer toward the border between the anterior and the posterior surface. This muscle right here is the flexor carpi ulnaris muscle. So that is the flexor carpi ulnaris muscle. It runs toward the pinky and you have the ulna is the medial bone. Why it is flexor? Because it is still on the anterior surface. Moving to this muscle right here. Now we are on the posterior surface. So this muscle is running toward the pinky. This is the extensor carpi ulnaris muscle. So notice how the extensor carpi ulnaris muscle is on the posterior surface, whereas the flexor carpi ulnaris muscle is on the anterior surface. Both are running toward the pinky, the ulna, the medial aspect. Moving to this muscle right here, if you follow the tendon of this muscle, this is the extensor digitorum muscle. Don't confuse the extensor digitorum muscle in the upper extremity with the extensor digitorum longus muscle in the lower extremity. Moving to this muscle right here, this muscle, we're still on the posterior aspect. This muscle is running toward the thumb. So this is the extensor carpi radialis longus muscle. Extensor carpi radialis longus muscle. Moving to this muscle right here, this is the brachioradialis muscle. Brachio from brachium, which is the arm, radialis, it is running toward the thumb where the radius is. That is the brachioradialis muscle. If we rotate the model, we're back to the starting point, which is the pronator teres muscle. 
and this right here is the flexor carpi radialis muscle so this is the flexor carpi radialis muscle whereas this right here is the extensor carpi radialis longus muscle and this right here is the palmaris longus muscle and we're back to the two ulnaris muscles I hope you found the video helpful. Hit the like button and subscribe for more amazing content.